Addressing health disparities and making health easily accessible through fitness and nutrition. It's possible and that's the goal of Grace Fitness. So joining us this morning, so excited, Zakia Jenkins, Executive Director of Grace Fitness. You're here to tell us all about an event happening this weekend. Good morning. Let's share some good positive morning. energy and get some fitness going today. <laughs> yes, good morning. Hi, Jackie. Thanks for having me. Um, yes, I am having a community health fair uh, this Saturday from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. at the Caremore Clinic, 1530 East Euclid. And this event is for everyone, but I really would like for people of color to come out and get their A1C check, get their blood pressure check, their weight check, know your numbers. That is so important. And also have a resource. There will be resources there to help you in your health journey. Yeah, let's so talk I am about so that. I'm so excited. Let's talk yes. about that. Well, first of all, thank you for doing this. Uh, yeah. I, we could all use yes. a little motivation, and your energy mm -hmm. is so contagious. So thank yes. you for that. But uh, thank you. Let's talk about those vendors. What can people expect if they come out this Saturday? Yeah, so this Saturday, we're going to have Veggie Thumper. She is uh, all natural and vegan. And I want to give people the opportunity if you are able to use your own money to try healthy foods, try it on Grace Fitness so you could taste what uh, a good healthy meal is like that's affordable. Um, we have uh, Al Wombo doing uh, self defense. We, I'm doing a a low impact workout. We have Horencia. She's doing a yoga session at 1045. So we just, we are just about being, having people to have access to health and wellness services. Yeah, just showing that there is that opportunity out there. And you had me at yes. Veggie Thumper because she is <laughs> so good. And that food, you might you might hear healthy in the background, but it tastes so good. So I challenge people yes. to go out and try it for the first time. You will be hooked. Uh, but I also understand yes. you are promoting education uh, uh, with this when it comes to fitness and even uh, along with getting vaccinated as well. Can you talk a little bit about that? Absolutely, because as we know, um, the COVID-19 has hit the African-American community hard because of these underlying health conditions. So education is key to show people that you don't have to try to do make changes all at once, right? Do small incremental things to improve your health. And so just having that education piece, there'll be educators out there to answer any questions about the the vaccine and, and have the vaccine available if you want to take it as well. Yeah, a lot of times it's just knowing there is access, there is education, getting yes. the right message out there. All right, Zakia, we need all the details once again. How can we get as many people out there in the community? Because you are doing such a great thing this Saturday. Thank you so much. Please come out. It is at the Caremore Clinic, 1530 East Euclid from 10 a.m. to 2 p.m. It's a drop in. You just come and go as you please. We're going to have prizes, give, just giveaways food, exercise, so it will meet, hopefully meet everyone's need and their expectation just to encourage them to get healthy. Love it. Thank you, my dear. It is yes, so wonderful to talk you. with you today, and we hope for a huge turnout because this is absolutely yes. wonderful for the yes. community. Thank you for making this happen. Yeah, thank you.